All right, Mo Harkless, how you doing, Mo? What's going on, man? All right, so you're a St. John's University guy. Yes, so sir. obviously March Madness is here. And let's say, for instance, they did all-time teams for each college. You got to put a starting five together for St. John all okay. time. Who's your starting five? Ooh, that's a tough one. Um, I'm going to go with Chris Mullen. Go with... Add yourself. So I'm going to get myself in there. All right, all right. <laughs> with Chris Mullen, I'm going to go with myself. I'm going to go with Malik Seeley, Ron Artest, and... Uh, ooh, it's a tough one. I, 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 I have to think about who I have being the big man. Uh, I'm not sure right now. So obviously going to St. John's is a known basketball school. The pressure of playing at St. John's, was it surreal for you? Or was it at the first moment when you stepped onto the court for the first game? How was that moment? I mean, it, it, it was amazing. I mean, I'm, I grew up watching St. John's. You know, uh, you know uh, I'm a neighborhood kid. I was from Queens. So just being able to just go out there and play in New York and play at home. I mean, it was, it was a crazy feeling. I mean, when you got all the media and all the pressure from just being in New York, and I mean, it's, it was just, it was amazing. All right, so you said you're a Queens guy, so that's another good question there. So, obviously, New York is known as the basketball mecca, mm -hmm. and then there's the cities, the boroughs. Yeah. Why is Queens the, the city of basketball? I mean, we, we produce the most pros. I mean, Queens, they say New York is the mecca. I mean, in New York, Queens got, I think Queens got the most pros. I mean, even tonight, you got Tobias from Queens, Kyle from Queens, I'm from Queens. You got a couple guys on the other team from Queens, too. So, we, uh, we kind of represent it well around the league. All right, so obviously we're sneakerwatch.com and we talk about sneakers. Or you're a guy that likes to collect sneakers or wear sneakers. And also I noticed that you like to wear Kobe's on the court. Yeah. So is that a comfort thing for you to wear Kobe's? Uh, yeah, I mean, I, I think I've been wearing Kobe's since I was in high school. So they, they're, they're comfortable. I'm used to them. Uh, I mean, I love them. They're light, too. So. All right, so off the court, what are some sneakers that you like to wear off the court? Um, I like to wear, I like, I like, I like Jordans. I wear a lot of Jordans. I mean, that's probably pretty much it. I mean, I wear a little bit of free runs with mostly Jordans. All right, so let's say you can make any kind of personalized custom shoe of Nike or a Jordan. And obviously with the theme that's going on with the Bugs Bunny, the Lola Bunny, the cartoon characters per se, if you can make your own cartoon character personalized shoe or some real shoe, what uh -huh. would it be? Um, I think I would do something with Batman. Batman, maybe Batman ones. One is my favorite Jordan, so I'd probably some some way at Batman ones. Something like that. Looking back on the season, what do you feel like this team improved on compared to last year, or just things like that in general? Um, I think we got a lot better defensively as a unit. You know, just uh, being able to, to guard other teams and, and using that to produce offense. I mean, I think we just we got we came together and we we all bought in. So I mean, I think we're more of a team this year. I mean, it's been up and down, but I think we've done a good job of staying together all year. Definitely a blessing, man. But more importantly, I think it's important that we we win it. We win the games, and I think that's, that's the most important part. Um, everybody on this team did a great job of uh, contributing and coming out every night and uh, giving us what they have. You picked the number. You picked the color wave. I probably got them. Most likely, I got them. I'm probably in the 90% category of the of the, of the Jordans. Maybe 88% of all of all flavors. But I'm I'm that's a that's a that's a high ratio. Yeah.